My name is Liam Vincent, Technical Lead for Operation Weed Eradication. And I'm Alice Harris. I'm the Technical Service Representative for Ohio. Since the early 1990s, weed control has increasingly relied upon herbicides alone and gone away from a comprehensive, integrated weed control approach. Some of the factors responsible for that movement have been the introduction of broad spectrum, selective herbicides, the introduction of herbicide tolerant crops, the shift to post-emergent herbicide weed control strategies alone, and finally, the increase in farm size. What's really interesting is that prior to the 1990s, there really isn't a lot of mention about pigweeds being a problem in row crops. We have seen that due to our reliance on the use of herbicides, we have seen an increase in resistance to weeds such as pigweeds over the years. Currently, we have 100 weed species that are resistant to at least two sites of action. And when we did an on-farm survey, about 80% of farmers are reporting glyphosate resistance on farm. What's also really interesting is that when we think about water hemp, it's currently resistant to at least seven sites of action, and Palmer amaranth is currently resistant to at least nine. So long story short, we have a problem. That's why we at BASF developed Operation Weed Eradication. It's a proactive way we're increasing awareness and setting the bar for a new mindset and approach to controlling pigweed specifically control of Palmer amaranth and water hemp. To be more in depth, Operation Weed Eradication is a cross-industry coalition energized by BASF. We bring together industry experts such as weed scientists and agricultural technology companies in order to showcase practices farmers can use in their battle against pigweeds. Our message is focused on four strategic crops, corn, soybeans, cotton, and rice. OWE uses a holistic approach to weed control grounded in sound agronomics and built on a foundation of three pillars, including the following. Cultural and mechanical practices, such as planting density, row width, and tillage. Seed trait selection and chemical control, such as overlapping residuals, consistently switching up modes of action. Finally, eradication diligence, such as mowing field edges and addressing problem areas, such as planter skips, to address those final issues. Incorporating this holistic approach by supporting Operation Weed Eradication to control your weeds on farm could mean many things. For one, you could reduce your risk of future crops by preserving future profitability of your land, as well as managing future herbicide costs and maintaining your farm's legacy. For more information about Operation Weed Eradication, contact your local BASF representative or visit OperationWeedEradication.com.